As you are doing your research, you will see references to other publications that you may want to follow up on. You may see these, for example, in a lab manual, in Wikipedia entries, and in other academic research. Sometimes these publications are called known items because they should exist since the writer would have read them to reference them. This video will show you a few ways to find them. So depending on the information that you have, um, there are again a few ways to find them. If the reference is for an article and the article title is available, like in this example, search for the article title in the library's big search box on the home page. Once you have pasted in the article title, if the university has access to that article, there will be a link to the full text. If you are looking for a book, search for its title on the library's homepage. With book titles that are brief, such as this one, adding at least one author will decrease the number of results. You can also um, kind of not out a lot of the other types of um, documents by choosing books on the left hand side. Make sure you have the edition that you're looking for and then click on the title. Right now with lockdown, you do have to request the book. Um, our staff will pick it up. You need to sign in using your UCalgary uh, email address or IT username and password. And then um, go down and hit the request button. You can optionally fill in whether you need the book or whether you don't need the book after a certain date and then hit request. When we're allowed back in the library physically, uh, you can copy down that call number from QC all the way to 2019 and um, go to the stacks to locate the book. So that's on the sixth floor, stack 169, which is denoted by that red stripe. So on the sides of each of the bookshelves, there will be a stack number. Now, if the article title is not included in the reference, um, this happens a lot um, in chemistry, the style just doesn't include a, an article title, you can try Google Scholar. Paste the whole reference into Google Scholar and then search for it. If there is um, something like a hit that shows up, uh, just double check the year and maybe the journal title, maybe the authors to make sure that the result that you're seeing uh, matches or corresponds with the thing that you're searching for. In that blank spot um, to the right um, is a link that you can set up so that it will link to the full text through the UCalgary library. So go into settings, library links, search for Calgary, then check the boxes related to the University of Calgary, and then uh, save. So there's the link on the right. When you click that, that will again kind of put you through um, the subscriptions and then through to the full text uh, for, the, um, for the article. There's the PDF there. Sometimes um, Google Scholar might not work or maybe the results aren't there. Um, what you can do if you have verified the, the link or verified the reference is available and find the article title, then you can use that article title and redo the search in the big search box. And lastly, if none of those techniques work, or if the reference is to a conference, which can be trickier to find, contact someone through the library, um, through chat or email. And if you're viewing this video on a research guide, contact information is usually found on the left-hand side near the bottom. Uh, if you're viewing this video on YouTube, um, there will be some notes um, for, um, for clicking through so that you can contact someone at the library.